what's going on so this has been a topic of discussion make sure you subscribe to the channel because this is the whole point of the video I appreciate the comments if you actually view the video I know I understand people can't view the whole video sometimes that's why I don't make longer videos okay also people are busy more so this is the really shit on the internet and listen Yes, I understand about being raw. You gotta understand, I'm a raw dude. I don't need the I don't need the edits. I don't need the cuts. Don't need the filter. Don't need the cleanups. Why? Because I'm a raw dude. Other people, see, you either know about being raw or you don't know. It's that simple. You don't know about what it's like to be raw, or you know what it's like to be raw. There, you can't, you can't, you know what I mean? You can't know one and not the other. <laughs> well, you can, <laughs> but you know what I'm talking about. So, the whole point of this video is, you know, people say this about their job and that. But your job sucks because your life sucks. Do you think if your life was good, your job would still suck? No. <laughs> so your job sucks, not because it sucks, because your life sucks. Why isn't it? Why are we getting into this? <laughs> well, most people online are fake. And that's what that's what's up with the edits and cuts and nonsense. There also is a stillness and something transmitted from me. So when you go and make the cuts and make the cuts and make the cuts, it sounds like people never shut the F up because they never shut the F up. And that's how their mind is actually in a rut. You can't tell it's in a rut. I can tell just by when someone speaks everything about them. They don't have to speak. I can tell just by looking at them. Now, it's different when you're in person through an online transmission. You get glued to the screen so it can make you lose your focus. Screens are can be detrimental. They can because people can be so fake, basically, and not who they really are. And you only catch a glimpse of their life. People could have put on a whole act. They could be reading off a prompt. They could have acted the whole skit out before. This isn't off a prompt. You know what I mean? This is always right off the top. Straight real. I don't need to do none of that. But that's not really the point of the video. I'm going to make a whole video about that. <laughs> but the whole point is, your job sucks because your life sucks. <laughs> Once you live a life that you want to live, you won't even probably have a job. Or it's not going to be considered a job. If you want to have be a fucking fireman, then go be a fireman. If you want to be a janitor out of high school, go be a janitor. That's on you. You can't be miserable about it. You chose the life. If you didn't chose the life, who chose it for you then? But you don't have an answer for that, motherfucker. So, because it's you. I can feel the resonance when I say things. <laughs> and it's not like I can't even be fake because it's not in me. I don't have to try because it's not. there's no envy. So, how to change your life? How to get a job that doesn't suck? Well, go live the life that you want to live. There's way too many chances, opportunities. Foreigners come over here just to get a regular 9 to 5. Mexicans drive up. Literally drive like a fucking golf club all the way through Mexico, through the border to the USA, just to fucking get get paid a fucking a little more from what they're paid down there, maybe, but just to get paid less than the average American worker and work fucking all the time. So it's just about the opportunity that you put in your mind. No one's fucking. Is there some people in some Auschwitz type of situations, chambers? Yeah, but guess what? You're in that situation. You're gonna either A, gonna get yourself out of it, or B, you're gonna fucking deal with it. You know what I mean? Or three, you can go cry about it. But crying about it ain't an option. 
because it's not going to do nothing. <laughs> there's only a few people, I mean, there's more than a few people in tight situations that need to get out of these sweatshops that are swept under the rug and not talked about for sure. Even famous people who are called gurus and leaders, you know, why is anybody fucking suffering at this point? Because they don't care about you, but they tell you they care about you. So your life sucks because you haven't took control of it. And that's why your job sucks. You can't have a fucking city job and a nice life. Like, they don't correspond. <laughs> now, theoretically, could you? Yes, like for some people. But once you learn to tap into your life, it doesn't matter what job you do. It's that freaking simple. But you'll be doing the job that you want to do or on your way to go do the job. You can do anything. You can go live in the woods if you want to. But you're a pussy and you want to live in the city. Sorry we're getting a little vulgar here today. <clears throat> but I brought the, brawl, the ball over here today. It's always with me. Always. <laughs> uh, people are just full of shit. Yeah. There's so many ways. There's people who make money on YouTube doing a bunch of shit. It's very easy to start your own business, but no one thinks of it. So, if you're not even going to think about it, why even tell you about it? <laughs> <laughs> so people that complain about their job pe people the reason why most people have shitty jobs is because they're chasing they're chasing very ma materialistic shit um and it's always about them once you because the world is about them the world is about them as in itself the world is going to change direction soon or some a couple people are they're going to change their energy and realize it's once you start giving shit to people and stop doing it for your own selfish need, for, you know, a family can become a selfish need really quick. It's not in its nature, but it does because people dedicate their whole life. Oh, I'm just going to give up my dreams. Because when you're, when you're young, feel this out. When you're young, everyone wants to give. It's a natural tendency to give. We're here to give. If you don't know, duh, now you know. Um, now you over reside that feeling, you, you, it's still a residue there, but you, but you push that feeling to the side because you're like, oh, well now I'm just going to be lazy. Now I'm just going to have this family work this nine to five job, forget about my dreams, feed into my girlfriend's needs and get on my knees. Meanwhile, she's the girl and, but, but you can get on your knees for the whole world. Why would you just get on your knees for your girl? That That is a real botch. That's a real botch. I don't care if you... I don't care if you really love your girl and charm her. But if you exclude the rest of the world from your love... Because love is a trans... It's a transmissional thing. A transitional thing. A transient thing. Meaning you can't see it. It's not just... Mm -hmm. Oh, I'm going to stick my stick in the hole. Ha, 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 ha. No, dude, way over that, way over that. People are still stuck in the fucking caveman, man-like mentality, which is fine. You can do that, but there's something above that, at least for you to realize it and not live that minuscule of a life thinking this is it and it's the end-all, do-all, because there's a lot more to life. In fact, that's nothing compared to the real picture, nothing. Anyways, have a nice day. Thanks for tuning in to this video. I hope it makes some sense. And if you have a job you don't like or a life you don't like because they correspond, they correlate, then change it. You are the one to change it. Most people change because it happens to them randomly and spontaneously. Most people aren't going to get that chance. Those people that had that are chosen ones and get very lucky. Some people get very lucky. They never have to deal with real difficulties in their life though it sounds like it's real difficulties it's not it's bitch work okay just being real <laughs> but thanks make sure you comment below tune into the videos and i appreciate it everyone if you want to make a donation snap crackle fizzle fizzle on the cash app cash app cash app I'm going to post it down below in the comments. It's also the same as we comments. I'm going to need some e comments. I'm going to need... Uh, it's the same as my username. Peace out.
See, this is a moment of silence. I can give it to you. They can't because they don't know how to do it. They probably don't even know what it is.